Now today's session we'll discuss about the vulnerability assessment using the tool Nessus. Here is my tool Nessus. First we need to login into the tool Nessus. So use the login credential which you use at the time of installation. So here is the interface to scan a, a system. First we need to go to the new scan. So there are several options are available. Advanced dynamic scan, advanced scan, audit cloud infrastructure, matlock detection, basic network scan, lots of options are there. So for the time being we are using advanced scan. So uh, in this field, first we need to put the name of the scan. Suppose the name is NPTEL and description is uh, demo, folder my scan and target. So in this case, my target is target IP address is 192.168.0.104 and 192.168.0.106. So this way we can use multiple IP address for scanning separated by now where is all the option for uh, discovery discovery option is uh, ping method ARP and TCP and it also used the ICMP and maximum number of tries is 2 that means it try twice for a particular request then port scanning part is also there to enumerate the local port to use SSH and WMI SNMP and only run network port scanner if local port enumeration failed so you can choose your own option then service discovery enumerate all SSL or TLS cipher now assessment part is there and in assessment part brute force assessment web application assessment then windows assessment and malware assessment all option are there you can choose your own option for the time being i'm off the scan for malware then report we can also use this option to generate the report and in advanced part there are some option are also there network timeout uh, here network timeout is 5 and maximum uh, simultaneous check per host that is also 5 maximum simultaneous host per scan that is also 5 you can also change your own option now where credential is there and plugin part are also there so we already installed plugin part which we show in the uh, tool installation part so all the uh, plugin are here which can help us to find out the different vulnerability right save this scan now i am starting the scan by clicking on the button launch 
the scan already started and it will take some time to complete the whole scan and once we got the scan result and by analyzing that result we can only find out the vulnerabilities and using that vulnerabilities further we can try to penetrate inside the victim machine so let's wait for some time to get the result of vulnerability scanning now see nasa's complete the scan so let's check the result so we basically scan for two system one is with the ip address 192.168.0.104 and it have several uh, vulnerabilities total 70 vulnerabilities there and out of this 70 vulnerability, 9 critical vulnerabilities there, 5 high vulnerabilities there, 23 medium vulnerability and 8 low vulnerabilities there and 129 that all are the information. And here is the details of all the vulnerability, uh, SSL, uh, multiple issue and uh, bind cell backdoor detection a cell is listening on the remote port without any authentication being required an attacker may use it by connecting to the remote port and sending command directly so using this vulnerability one can attack to the victim machine and some other vulnerability is also there uh, let's check the other ip address 192.168.0.0 uh, 106 it have total 21 vulnerability and uh, one critical vulnerability is there and two uh, medium vulnerability is there and 36 information is there and C uh, MS 17-010 security update for microsoft windows smb server and the remote windows host is affected by the uh, vulnerability with the cv number 2017-0143 cv 2017-0144 cv 2017-0145 and also cv 2017-0146 and cv 2017-0148 and information disclosure vulnerability is also uh, exist in this machine and some other vulnerability is also there like uh, in medium vulnerability ms17-047 is also there remote uh, windows host is affected by an elevation of uh, privilege vulnerability in the uh, sam and local security authority So all the vulnerability and the possible solution are listed here. So this way we can find out all the vulnerability using the tool Nasus. And further we use all these vulnerability to penetrate inside the victim machine. So this phase is basically called vulnerability assessment phase and in vulnerability assessment phase we find out all the possible way by which an attacker can penetrate inside the victim machine but in the next phase that means in penetration testing phase an attacker can try with all these vulnerability to uh, check which vulnerability is working and which one is not so that is called penetration testing So in the next week, in next tutorial, I will show you how to use all the thing up, all the information gathering part, which we covered in this week and using all that information, how can one penetrate inside the victim machine? Thank you.